Hey everybody out there in digital land, we got another success story on the K Lager. This is like from Star Trek stuff. So we got a special guest here. What's your name, sir? Luke. Luke. Yep. Can I call you Mr. Luke for this video? Of course. Yeah, you just want to loosen up a little bit, Luke. You, this is this is we can all we can edit all your nervous nervous parts out. <laughs> Me? Nervous? Yeah, yeah so uh, this is the K Laser. This stuff is from like Star Trek, right, Luke? That is, uh, yeah, it's beam me up Scotty material. <laughs> beam me up Scotty. Yeah. So uh, let me take these off. So, uh, Luke, you've had, how many treatments do you think you've had? 12 maybe? Uh, yeah, I'd say upwards of 9 to 12. 9 to 12. So tell the audience here uh, what's happened. You had like chronic numbness or tingling? Yeah, in I just right developed arm? in my right shoulder. I had some kind of tension uh, up here, and then with um, uh, I, I had pain somewhat radiated down my arm and my finger, my and thumb. Yeah, had, they had like chronic tingling in them. Yeah, and nothing would really alleviate it. And how, how long did you have that for? How long was it going on for? It was like three weeks. Uh huh. So. Three yeah. weeks too long. Yeah, three weeks too long, right. And you said you had, like, carpal tunnel surgery on? Previously, uh, yeah, previously. like 15 years ago. 15 years ago. And then we just did a K laser, and you said, like, this doesn't even touch even the surgery that you had with the K, with uh, with the carpal tunnel. Right, right. I mean, the carpal tunnel surgery was a method of last resort, very invasive, and yeah. with all the rec extended recovery time. Uh, the K laser, um, which I had no... Um, I had hope, but no ex set expectation of of uh, what it would relief it might bring. Yeah, and it just um, changed their case around. T totally, totally. Yeah, yeah. And this thing, I don't know if you know this, Luke, but this thing's like FDA. The Star Trek, the K Lander's <laughs> FDA approved, man. Yeah, yeah. I I read up a little bit on it. I know that it was introduced in Europe in 1974. Oh yeah, laser light. Okay, yeah. You know? Yeah. And it took a while to get to the U.S. Like everything, right? I mean, yeah. They'd rather give you drugs. Here. Right. Drug you up and cut you up. Drug you and cut you up so you walk around <laughs> like a zombie. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. But this was non-invasive. It left a warm, pleasant feeling in my uh, areas where I got treated on my shoulder, forearm, and into my hand. Yeah. Um, it takes all of maybe a 10-minute treatment. Yeah. yeah, right, right. Time for treatment. And it produces a nice, soothing humming sound as it yeah, operates. Yeah. So you're listen to some nice humming sound. Yeah. Yeah. So your arm is much better then, right? It the is. Thing, yeah. yeah. Okay. Bottom line is my arm, I would say, is about 90% better. 90% better, folks. 90%. I mean, that's my subjective uh, take on this, but true, truthfully speaking, uh, my tingling is, tingling in my uh, affected area is almost gone completely. Yeah. Okay, cool. It's really pretty much completely gone. Um, and I feel like the... I feel like a million bucks. It's your birthday yeah. today, 48. It is, yeah. Yeah, 48. 48. 48, happy birthday. Thank you. So if you're out there suffering, um, there's hope for you, man. You don't have to go and get cut. You don't have to go and get drugs. You just need to get some right advice to get help. What would you say to anyone out there that's listening to this here, Luke? I would implore you to please give... Implore, I like that. I implore. like that word. Implore. Yeah, implore. Right? Yeah, to uh, consider the treatment and it uh, is money well spent. Yeah. It's uh, everybody likes to hang on to their money if or whatnot. But can't take it with you. No, you can't take it with you, and might you, as well have good health. You can't take it with right. you. Right, health as well. I mean, I don't think your kids are going to like you know just put all the cash in your grave, are they? <laughs> no, no, no. They're not going to bury the cash with you, are they? No, no, okay, no, <laughs> so, not at all. All right, peace out.